Tyson the Subaru Specialist here, and today we're taking a look at the Cascade Green Silica Subaru Forester Limited, the full load Forester. It's powered by a 2.5 liter four cylinder boxer engine, producing 182 horsepower. Plenty of power for a vehicle of this size. You get a great mix of power and economy. You have 8.7 inches of minimum ground clearance, which is more than your standard half ton pickup truck. Full time symmetrical all wheel drive. And of course, at the back here, we have a power lift gate you can activate from the key fob, the door, or the driver's seat. There are backup sensors integrated into the rear bumper. They'll apply the brakes if it thinks you're going to hit something between 1 and 15 kilometers an hour in reverse. And there's a ton of room in behind the second row seats of the Forester. Very boxy square rear end, equates to a tall, wide, and deep amount of storage. Cargo tray, standard equipment. And our privacy cover can be tucked underneath here. Just goes in those squares. We have grocery bag hooks on either side, along with a 12 volt power point on the rear driver's side. The ability to fold the seats, the click of a button, and we do also get the Harman Kardon upgraded audio system in the Limited. In the hatch, we have an LED cargo light. We can close it, lock and close it. You can pull it down. You can close it from the key fob or from the driver's seat as well. Second row, tons of room. Lots of headroom, lots of legroom. Taller people are gonna fit comfortably even those with longer legs. And of course, being limited, the full load, you get the leather upholstered interior. You can see that sign side is reclined a little bit. You have the ability to recline this by pulling on this and leaning back on the seat. There's a fold down armrest out of the center seat, integrated cup holders in that. And out of the center console, we have vents, heated seats for the outer two passengers and two USB ports to keep everyone connected on those longer trips. There are three map back pockets on either side for storage. And the rear door card is soft touch along with the armrest. A little bit of storage there with a bottle holder and child locks if you need those. Now it is a proximity key. Key never needs to come out of your purse, your pocket, your bag, your backpack. Just needs to be within 46 inches. And to lock it, we simply touch these lines. It's locked, you wait a second, walk back up, put your hand in the handle, and it unlocks. Front door card looks very, very similar with the soft touch. Front two windows our auto power, regular power for the rear, along with window lock. We've got power mirror adjustment and two position memory settings for your power mirrors and your power driver seat. Power controls are down there and it's the same leather upholstered interior up front as it is in the second row. And you do get the panoramic sunroof moonroof combo. In the Forester with it running, right hand side of the steering wheel, we have our adaptive cruise and lane centering. Both of those systems use those two black boxes to look for cyclists, pedestrians, road lines, and other vehicles. They also do automatic emergency braking. Below that, heated steering wheel. Absolutely fantastic feature, especially here in the north. We've got our climate controls up front here, or up top, and it ranges from 15 on the low side all the way up to 29. You can sync it back to driver really easily. See your fan strength, see where your airflow is being directed. And you can see there's a little screen up top there. That's the driver focus system. And that will try to scan you in and tell you if you're distracted or drowsy. You can also do your memory settings off of that. We have an easy to use eight inch infotainment system from Subaru. It is all touchscreen, including nav. We also have physical buttons down below there. As soon as we put it in reverse, the backup camera pops up. Rear assist braking's on, parking sensors are on. You can see the top of the bumper there and you can clean the backup camera from inside the vehicle. Below that, driver's side temperature, fan strength, passenger side temperature. And we have a little media storage cubby down there with two USBs and auxiliary and a 12 volt power point. This is rubberized and is designed, designed to be device storage. It is an automatic CVT with a manual mode. We can use the paddles to upshift or downshift as we see fit. Behind that, we have X mode, dual function X mode in the limited. And that's like four x four low in a pickup for that really extreme off-road stuff below 40 kilometers an hour. We have heated seats, high and low for both the driver and passenger on physical toggle switches. And then up top, we have an auto dimming rear view mirror. No switch to flick, just automatically dims if someone has their brights on behind you, fantastic. Your side mirrors are also auto dimming and tied to this. Then we have these three buttons here and that is the home link system. You can hook up to three separate garage doors to your mirror and you don't have to carry a bulky opener on your visor. So that is a quick look at the 2024 Subaru Forester Limited in the Cascade Green Silica, stock number 24FR3353. And you can find it down here at the corner of First and Victoria, Subaru of Prince George.